won't believe what I got for free in today's video. Alrighty guys, it is Sunday, it is early, and ooh, someone left some VHSs on the table. Hey everybody, it is Rocco the Great, superstar artist, creator of Goose Faba, coming to you with another flea market video slash toy hunt slash you're gonna want to stay tuned for this one. In today's video, we actually find a ton of good stuff for free. I also get a lot of things at the flea market. We go over those and we hit up some stores and I give you guys a lot of tips and tricks on where to get certain stuff at certain stores and also a lot of toy photography diorama tips in today's video. It's a little bit of a mix mash. You're gonna like it. And before we get to the video today's shirt of the day is i just want a toy hunt guys i have merch if you want to support the channel we want some cool merch today's customer pick of the day is damn looking good go buy a shirt get some cool threads and enough talking let's get to the video Alrighty, guys it is sunday it is early and oh someone's someone left some vhs's on the table okay i'm taking these all right, we scored already, man. Four things of all VHS tapes on a table for free. Perfect. Perfect. So that's a cool thing about the flea market is people just leave stuff on their table for you to take instead of them throwing it out in the garbage or anything. Just scored already. And we just got here. I didn't even wake up yet. Oh, hat for my kid. That's like a cool, is this a real spider? Is this a real? I don't know, it looks like bootleg, but that's pretty cool. Maybe I'll ask how much that is later. I can't believe it. I love Planet of the Apes. I just got all the VHSs for free. I don't even know what else is in there. I'm going to have to go through that later. Oh gosh. I loved these growing up. I might have to get these. All right, guys, we are back. We just got all of our stuff. We're gonna go home. I might stop at some places. At the end of today's video, we are gonna go through all the stuff that I just got today, but I have to go home and drink my coffee. I didn't drink my morning coffee or eat my breakfast yet. Let's go. All right, guys, quick toy hunt into Hobby Lobby. For all you diorama makers and toy photographers, hit up your hobby stores right now, like Hobby Lobby. They have these miniature pumpkins, miniature hay bells, and usually around Christmas time, they have like miniature Christmas items and stuff like that. So they're not in the back dollhouse section area. So you just gotta check all over, especially when they're changing the seasons. So I'm in the clearance section of Hobby Lobby and I see a Transformers model kit. I'm like, it's on clearance. It's because somebody built it. What? What? How do they, how do you even, are they Hobby Lobby for real? You blew it! And if you're into toy photography and just even action figure collecting and you want some more e extra accessories, definitely hit up your Hobby Lobbies. They have tons of them. Look at them. They're pretty cheap. And they usually go on sale sometimes and they got all different types like look rug for a diorama They got the microwave There's so many fun little diorama Accessories action figure accessories and these are all in great scale with your Marvel Legends If you are looking for some cool Jurassic Park stuff hit up your Hobby Lobby. They got these really cool posters uh, But who's gonna tell them that uh, Godzilla is not Jurassic Park? Another thing I'm always telling people about is the action figure selection at Hobby Lobby is pretty good and it's only getting better. Like we're getting McFarlane toys here now, we're getting Bandai, Pokemon, model kits, a lot of anime stuff. If you're into any of this stuff, they even got Funko Pops, they got Gundam, look at these little banks of the anime characters, they got those Japanese statues from those anime stores, so many things man you definitely want to check out. Oh yeah and even fig pins. Okay. Another place you're gonna want to check right now is Dollar Tree again with the seasonal items If you want some Halloween diorama decorations or for your action figures, maybe your Michael Myers NECA figure check your Dollar Tree 
Now, this isn't for me, but I know a lot of you guys are big Funko Pop collectors, and I would go run over to your Five Below right now because Five Below has some crazy Funko Pops. I saw a lot of people were like, I need these, I need these. The wrestling ones aren't that easy to come by. So go check them out. They're only five bucks. So I wanted a behind the door hoop for my 90s room. And what's more 90s than the behind the door hoop? But I found this one at the flea market and it said Tina on it. So what I did was I had some stickers and I want to start covering this whole thing in stickers. So if you have a brand or if you make a sticker or something like that, you want your sticker on here. My PO box is in the description of all my YouTube videos. Feel free, send one in. I want to fill this up with people's stickers. So I got What A Funk. Uh, I got Birdhouse. This is a vintage birdhouse from the 90s that was under a Target floorboard on a toy hunt. I found that. And then there's Goose Faba. So let's fill this up. I'm going to start documenting it too. Cool. Perfect. All right, guys, I just got back from the flea market and we got a ton of stuff. As you saw, these are all free, free VHSs. We're going to go through those. But I also got, so this book, this is one of my favorite artists, Ashley Wood. Uh, he makes these zombie robot toy things. And uh, this is one of his books, but he only did the cover art. And he does have some prints back here. So look right there, that's him. That's Ashley Wood right there. There's some prints right here. And I might, I think I'm actually just gonna cut these prints out <laughs> and maybe we'll frame them or something. But uh, this was, look, see? Art Gallery by Ashley Wood right there. This is just like a normal comic and it's got zombies and robots and stuff like that. I'm sure it's fine, but I really just bought it for being one, you know, one of my favorite artists. They had $3 on this and I paid them $2 in quarter not even quarters i had like dimes and nickels that i just wanted to get i had a bag of change and i paid them with that so two bucks not bad for that then this is another person's table and i think i scored on this table so we got this mcdonald's chicken nugget halloween plate now i've sold these before these sell really quickly and like i'm sure i think this is good especially with halloween approaching then i have a sealed playstation I'm sure this isn't like a really good game, but it's still sealed and it's still PlayStation. So I picked that up. And then this is memories right here, guys. Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, 2004, this is from. I grew up and I remember Roller Coaster Tycoon was a big deal. What I was doing with this lady's t uh, table was bundle. Always try to bundle if you can. So she was asking a dollar each item. This is sealed Looney Tunes stamp book. And I think there's even stamps in here. See, it's post office, official, USPS. Usually they include a stamp or so. So all this stuff, four items, I got them for $3. Just because they were nice, I was gonna even say $2, but they were being really nice. And I'm sure this alone is gonna sell pretty quickly. Then I got this, the Stephen King six film edition. These are a lot of movies that I've been wanting to see. Uh, I know Christine, I, I think Christine is John Carpenter. Uh, then I found, I found this little mini uh, vinyl on the floor. Bless you. Uh, hold me now. You know that song. Hold me now. Oh. Yeah, so I, I, that was free 99. Now I'm going to go through these VHSs and then I'll show you guys anything of note. Okay, so it's a lot more garbage than good, but it was still free. So a lot of these are just very kid stuff. I actually might keep the Hercules. Uh, some decent stuff here. It's We even got some uh, video head cleaner tapes. But this is what I was interested in. So we have a blank tape from Blockbuster. These two are blank. I want to check those and see what's on there. We got E.T. Grinch, Ninja Turtle, a lot of Pokemon. I have Batman Forever, so I actually might put that in this pile. But this was what I was looking for. And they're even missing the video, uh, the movie that I hate. So I hate the Battle of the Planet of the Apes, the last one. Oh, here it is. Damn. So what, which one are we missing? Hold on. We have, oh, Beneath. Oh, we're missing. And then Battle. Damn. I played myself, but they were still free. And uh, I'm just missing one now, and I'll have the complete collection. I love Planet of the Apes. If anyone's new here, you didn't know that. So not a bad day today. I'm going to go drink my coffee, eat my breakfast, stay great. Hit that like button, leave a comment, and uh, I'll see you in the next toy hunt. Thank you guys for watching. What did you think of today's video? 
Let me break in here and say shout out to all my channel members. You guys are amazing. You guys help support the channel so that we could keep pumping these videos out for everybody to enjoy. So not only do you get a lot of exclusive content, you get monthly gifts that I send out to you for free. So down below is the link. Join up to become a channel member today. It's basically like a Patreon, but it's on YouTube. So you support me monthly and yeah, you're basically a saint. All right, let's get back to the video. Hey guys, I just put up a ton of brand new stuff on my merch website. Link is always down below. Buy some merch. Want to send something into the channel? I have a P.O. box. Everything gets opened up in their own video on the channel.